Hey fellas, welcome to my playthrough of VHS Slaughter. So this game came out the other day, I believe, and uh, all I really know about it is that you're some guy, some college student that works at an old VHS rental store. And I was like, hey, I remember that. I didn't work there, but I was, you know, I was the guy that rented the games and then brought them back all fucked up. So that's me. Anyway, I hope all of you guys are doing well. Believe it or not, not Goku won the last drink bowl. So we're going to be drinking not Goku soda and it is melon flavor. I'm not sure if the picture even showed that when I put it up. <laughs> I guess really what you're voting for is the character. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is another one of those drinks from Ocean Bomb, which I thought was the flavor like the other day, but no, it's actually the brand. So Ocean Bomb makes these drinks and I drink them. So let's see, melon flavor. It looks like a melon flavored drink, I'll tell you that. It smells like... It smells kind of nostalgic. It kind of reminds me of like the candy aisle at Blockbuster, which is kind of coincidental that I'm playing this game, right? So I kind of I kind of really like the smell, but the taste must be poison if it smells like the most artificial melon of all time. Let's see. That is like the most mild flavor of all time. It is melon, but it's more like cotton candy. It's like melon cotton candy in liquid form. And it's not bad, but it's also not good. It's like not, it's not insulting to the palate, I guess. But it's also not doing it any favors, you know what I mean? I'll drink it though, not bad. Anyway, press E to start. Wow, no intro. Oh snap, I'm going to be late for work. Okay, there is an intro. If only rent was cheaper in Firemore, I wouldn't have to work night shifts every day. Well, actually, uh, you don't work them every day, you work them every night. And maybe if you were just a little bit smarter, you wouldn't have trouble with your rent. Just fucking kidding. <laughs> I'm a genius and my rent is fucking astronomical. It's not even fair, it's actually torture. But let's not talk about that. We're here to play VHS Slaughter. Oh. That must have hurt. The way it smacked my knee and pushed me a whole foot back. Alright, so we have the washing machine right next to the bathtub. That's gotta be... That's gotta be a hazard. I mean, I don't know, but I wouldn't put electrical stuff like that right next to me. We are poor. It just occurred to me that we are very poor. This is a very poor person. <laughs> Maybe not globally, but... In this country, which I'm assuming is America. Definitely. Um, it's asking me if I want to go outside, so that... Does that mean there's something I could do in here? I don't think so. Fuck it. Let's go outside. Can I... There's no settings menu, so I guess we just go outside. Cool. I, uh, I wish I could boost up my mouse sensitivity, but it's not bad. It's just really slow. This is where I take cover from drive-bys in my hood. Wow, I have plenty of these. What the hell are these? I don't know what these are supposed to be. Uh, okay. Alright, you know what? Let's not... We're asking too many questions. And I already warned you about that in the other video. Okay, it seems that the lights only... seems that the lights are activated by my vision. This guy is... <laughs> very worried about parking in the wrong place. I should get to the bus station. I don't want to be late. Wait, is his car... No. No. The, the, the light pole is inside of his car, right? Am I wrong? I'm right. And I'm tired of it. I'm right all the time. This is kind of nice, though. I like the sky. The atmosphere's not bad, but this is most definitely the hood. I've never seen an exploded, abandoned car in someone's front yard. And they're protecting it. <laughs> they're like, that's my metal. I'm keeping it. So they put it behind their fence. 
We gotta get to the bus stop. We should get to the bus station. Dude, if I knew where that was, if I lived your life for the 22 years that you've been alive, I'd know where that is, but I don't. But I think I found it, so it's fine. Alright, so that we do we Oh okay, here we go. Capcrow Games presents You wanna open up for me? Nice. Ow. My ear didn't like that. This game is oddly quiet. Does anybody else feel that? I feel like... Alright, there we go. VHS Slaughter. New horror section. Sweet. Can't see a fucking thing. This place is lit terribly. I work here, right? I can just kind of go... Oh, nope. If I can't go to the back, then what can I do? Oh, okay, here we go. Can I read? Hey man, sorry for today, I had to leave a bit early, you know? I've got a date with that hot chick I told you about. Anyway, don't forget to take out the trash. I'll tell you how it went tomorrow night. Cool, dude, I can't wait to hear about it. I've never cared, but... Oh, I realize what's happening now. My mouse is going over to my other monitor because it's not locked to the game. Okay. That could be a problem one of these days. Yeah, if I if I click, then I can't control the game anymore. That's all right. We'll deal with that. We'll burn that bridge when we cross it, you know what I mean? For now, we gotta take out the trash. Which, again, I don't know where it is, but I found it. Sweet. Man, I miss Blockbuster. I think there was one open, still. Uh, but I don't know. I actually don't know. Just that's it, right? That's all the trash. I wanted to go there. I don't I don't even know where it's located. It might be worth going out there if it's uh still open. What's up, man? You look like you could rent a movie. Oh, three. Oh, you're returning them. Well, fuck, I don't know where to put these. Usually there's just a bin and you throw them in. Hannah. Hello, my dear. I'd like to return these tapes my husband got last week. Such great, lovely stories. We both like watching romantic movies when we are alone in the house. Hee <laughs> hee. Anyway, I'm kind of nervous coming here alone at night. An old lady like me shouldn't be out late at night anyway. Oh lord, what am I saying? All those cases with missing people lately scare me. And to think that Firemore was a very peaceful town back in my days. Anyway, I'll go now. Sorry for bothering you with all my rumbling. Yeah, you know, I'm a pretty nice guy, but I'm working retail right now, so I don't really care about anything. I actually would rather you just go away, because I work retail. This guy's making what? I'm assuming at this time, 550 an hour and he's got rent yeah no way dude where do i put these oh okay sweet this mouse sensitivity is killing me what do i do do i have like a list of chores or can i go around the back of the Oh, customer. Stay behind that line. This looks like the guy from Mythbusters. What's his name? Jamie? Rob. Hey, man. 
Look, I wanted to watch a movie tonight with my girl, but on the way here, I realized I don't have any money on me. Can you give me a tape and I'll pay you back once I have the money? What? What do you mean, no? Come on, man. Poof. Your tapes are crap anyway. Look, you're working at night all alone here. I don't think you'd like to piss off the wrong person. Remember that. Shut up, Rob. Go bust a myth, dude. Idiot. Like, I'm scared of you. With your fucking beret and mustache. Only thing you're missing is a bandolier and a war story. My shift is finished. Time to go home, I guess. That's it? That's it? Dude, we have a sick job. This is a fantastic job. We don't even have to wait for anybody to, like, come take over for us. Nah, 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 I, I'm, I'm, I'm going around, alright? I'm checking this place out. Can I open this? No. Alright, keep in mind that there's a ladder. This is where the power is, I guess. And a vending machine. Sounds good. Alright, well, let's go home, I guess. Loading. Oh, sweet. Oh, come on now. What does that mean? I'm going to be late again? Didn't you have a mirror? What happened to your mirror? Is this a nightmare? I'm going to be late again. Whoops. Hmm. Guy doesn't eat, he doesn't sleep, he just works. Again, nothing in there. Damn, man. Alright, well, let's go, I guess. We don't want to piss off the wrong guy. <laughs> oh. I don't really have anything to say about what's going on either. I don't know what kind of crazy twist the story's gonna take. I mean, I guess nothing is scarier than just an actual bad guy, you know? Like, yeah, demons and ghosts or whatever, yeah, it's scary, but... At the end of the day, I don't think there's anything scarier than just some guy, right? That's what I think. Fuck off with that. I hate that bus driver. I hate him. <laughs> I'm gonna be the guy that he's worried about. Well, let's hope that our... Our co-worker is here for once. He was gonna tell me about his girl. I guess it's not his girl, but... Let's see. He loves to write notes. Hey, Greg. Okay, we're Greg. It's Matt. Sorry for leaving early again. Something urgent came up. Anyway, the date went really well. I really think Mary likes me. Oh. Also, I finally fixed the surveillance camera. You can see at the top right of the counter, and please don't forget to take out the trash. Top right of the counter. Oh. Fuck. Well, I'm gonna take out the trash, because... You know, duh. What am I supposed to be looking for? Ah, uh, okay. All well, the trash still has to get taken out, you know what I mean? Get the fuck inside! Alright. It's Grandma coming back. I kind of miss her. What, what are we supposed... I guess we just wait, right? I mean, I don't know. There's no other chores. I don't think there's more trash. And also, if we do see something, what do we do about it? Oh, that guy just spawned in. Let me take a drimp of... Drimp. Let me take a drimp of my soda. What's up, man? You look scary. Daniel. 
Hello. What's up, Daniel? I came to return these horror tapes I got last week. Really good stories, by the way. Thanks for recommending them to me. You know, I can't say no to a good slasher story. Sometimes I wonder what it'd be like to go out and start chopping heads off and then hang them at the top of my fireplace. Who? Whatever. Nah, I'm kidding. Yeah, I'm sure you are. I'd store them at a secret room behind my closet. Ah, kidding again. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. I think that might be the most trustworthy person we've seen so far. What do you guys think? Now what? I don't even know if this camera works. It could just be a picture. No, 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 no. Oh. Let me put these away before I get in trouble. Can I not put these away before I get in trouble? Whoa, whoa! Dude, I almost went to the back rooms just now. Something's wrong with this thing. I don't like it. I, I hate it. Oh, maybe I have to put them in here. Ah, nice. Nah, 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 nah. Let me check the tape. See, the thing about this game right now is that if something were to jump out at me and scare me, I'd have to throw my headset into the wall because it's pretty loud right now. Ah, fuck it, let's go. Is there a killer amongst us? No, but he's a magician. I don't know how he was doing that. Be very careful with this backrooms teleporter here. Actually, I want to try it. Let's see what happens. Oh boy. Man, do we really want to watch this obvious serial killer tape? He was walking back home alone. You would think he had some security with him. With how much money he embezzled, you would also think he had a nicer house. Okay. Am I playing? No. I wonder what he spent all of that money on, if not security or a nicer home. Um... I guess I will never find out what our mayor wasted our money on. You killed the mayor? Well, you're not gonna do anything to me, right? I mean... Why would you go from... Who left this? I don't think I should go now. I think I should go now. I don't feel safe anymore. Listen, man. You can't go from high-ranking political figures to a guy called Greg, all right? That's not fucking fair. You leave me the fuck alone. I don't even understand why you would want to kill me. Am I a criminal? Oh, fuck, hold on. I gotta check the... Okay, no, there's nobody there. Damn, 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 dude. Wait a second. Oh, no. I thought there was something at my feet. Yeah, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Something just spawned in or lagged. I don't like it. Oh, take me. Take me home. What was that tape? Was it real? No, it can't be. It was probably a prank by a kid. Can't you just turn on the news or... Look at a newspaper? Because, I mean, the mayor is a big deal, dude. You know? Like, I don't know. I feel like you would know if that guy died. In any case, 
they're a killer in here. Oof. Someone ate my dinner. And I can't do anything else, so let's leave. And it's raining now. That's just great, dude. I still have no fucking idea what's gonna happen to us. Not very obvious, is it? The great atmosphere. Yeah, yeah, let's go. It gets me every time. Alright, there's a blue van. Let me check the perimeter. Let me scope out the place, you know. Can I open this? Nope. Can I climb the ladder? Nope. It's good to do this every now and then, you know. You never know when you might run into a serial killer in a blue van. Alright, Matt must have left me another note because he's a dick. Oh, he didn't. Oh, he's somewhere around here dead. He left me food. That's kind of cool. Is that the TV? Well, we know it works because we can see the rain. But what else do we do? There's not even trash in here. I don't... Oh, okay. There he is. The man with the blue shirt. Purple? Twitch Prime? Harry. Hey. I, I, I'd like to buy these two tapes. The, the Blade Walker and the Whiting, yes. Hey. Did, did, did you see the guy across the street? Why is he looking directly at the store? He he really freaked me out. It, is, is he a junkie or something? Anyway, thanks for the tapes. If I, if I were you, I'd leave right now and maybe call the police. You should c close the store and leave. And do what, man? Wait for the bus? You want to give me a ride? You know there's a fucking killer out there? Besides, you know, it's not cool to call him a junkie. You don't know that. He could just be a guy or homeless. I think he's right. I should go now. Go fucking where, Greg? Where the fuck are you gonna go, Greg? Are you gonna wait 15 minutes at the bus stop in the rain? I mean, I don't mind. I'll go, but... I just don't think it's a good idea, Greg. Fuck. Greg has balls, dude. It's, uh... Where's the guy across the street? I don't even know. Fuck it, let's go look for him. I don't see anybody. What happens if we go this way? Nothing. He mentioned across the street, so it feels like it'd be, like, over here, but... He doesn't mean the van, does he? Or... You know what? Not my problem. You know what my problem is? I gotta... The bus is late again. I fucking hate whatever that is. I've been hearing that. What is that? The fucking radio. Oh my god, I gotta open the wardrobe again. Here we go.
Oh, what a nightmare. Yeah, dude. Totally. Come on, keep it together. It's the TV. Oh, it wasn't a... It was a nightmare, I guess. Dude, I don't know, man. I don't think you're safe. I think you need to call the... I don't know. <laughs> Move back in with mom, dude. Do something. This ain't right. TV's dead. And now we go out here and we wait for the bus stop. We don't, well, we don't wait for the bus stop, we wait for the bus, but you know what I mean. Rain, rain, go away. Let's go. Oh my god. My review of this game is going to mention that fucking horn, I swear it. Immediate deduction of like three points. I'm kidding, but still, I hate it. It's just so much louder than everything else in the world. In the game, really. Oh, hey man, hold on. The employee's not even in there. Cool, cool your jets. Hey, I can help you. I'm Greg. Oh, it's Hannah. Oh my dear, something terrible happened. I didn't know where else to go. I had to come here to speak with someone about it. It's James, my husband. I can't find him anywhere. He went for his usual walk, but he didn't return. He's always been back at seven. He's never late. What should I do? Could this serial killer person abduct him? It's all over the news. They believe someone is responsible for all these missing people. Oh Lord, I tried to call the police, but they didn't bother. They have more important cases to investigate. Oh Lord, I have to get back. Hannah, it's cool if you want to chill here. Like, I 100% I understand it. You could stay here all night if you want. Because I don't want to deal with this alone either. But uh, also, man, the police in this world, much like every other horror game ever, is total garbage. I guess. A new case? Nah, we don't have... Oh. Just anybody that appears, I'm like, fuck that. <laughs> oh, it's cool guy Harry, right? Oh no, you're Rob. You're fucking Jamie. Oh no, you're Derek. Hello. I'd like to return these. Man, I hope the weather gets better. Anyway, thanks. Bye. What, what are they? I don't know what... You didn't tell me what they were. I don't know where to put them. Yeah, it's a trap, isn't it? You hear that fucking ambience? What's up, homie? Sorry, we're closed for tonight. It's cool, dog. You stay in there. Sorry, we're closed for tonight. Doesn't fucking budge. Yeah. 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 Get out of here. Movies have been put back. That's a car alarm? Greg, can't you see? I don't think we're going to make it out tonight. They want me to go investigate that stupid alarm. Like it's my job to do that. Okay. Oh, something loaded in, dude. I felt the game stutter. I don't suppose this game has multiple endings, right? Oh 
Oh, cool. The ambience went away. I think we're safe. I fucking hate this. I think I'm supposed to go outside and investigate the car. But who would? Who would? Okay. Alright. Did you fucking see the lag? Did you experience it? Hello? I'm going home. I went home. I didn't even tell myself I was going home that time. He just kind of like said fuck it and went. I hate that TV. I hate that it always comes on. Why do we own it? What good is it? Please don't scare me. Cool. No lunch again. Or dinner. Whatever. Yeah, let's go outside. At this point, this killer's taking his sweet time. What if there's no killer at all? Wouldn't that be an insane twist? Like, there's, there's just nobody after you. It's just all in your head. You just... All these stories and stuff. The human condition. That's the... That's the mechanic of this horror game. Nah. <laughs> I don't expect that to be the case. That'd be too... I don't know. Too experimental for this game, I think. Or for indie games these days. Only a genius such as I would tap into that market. This car is always here, man. I'm like... Wondering whose it is, but I guess it's not my job to care. These locked doors... They got me wondering if... I can open them. Every time I'm expecting Matt's dead body in there. Hey Greg, it's me, your co-worker. I decided to leave Firemore. I guess you won't ever see or talk to me again. Oh well. I never really liked this godforsaken town anyway. Crime being on the rise and cops not doing anything about it. People who look death... Bleh, people who look dead both on the inside and on the outside. This town deserves people like these. Well, Matt. I don't blame you, dude. Yes. Dawn. Hey. Oh, no. I'm not here to buy tapes. I saw a nosy guy outside. He told me to come here and tell you he's giving you an invitation. I don't know anything more. He just gave me five bucks to come here and tell you that. He said you should be very careful with your choice. Fucking excuse me? Listen, Don. You idiot. Have you ever considered the possibility that that might be a stalker and that you should fucking phone the police or something? Oh, what am I, too late? The power went off. have to go out and check the breaker box. And I don't believe we can just open this door and go outside. Nope. Can you guys even see? I like, why are these lights on? But they're not. <laughs> uh, the breaker box is on this side. Breaker box? Is this not it? What the fuck is a breaker box? This looks like the breaker box. It's not this, right? This is a vending machine. This is a bunch of concrete slabs. I don't think that's the breaker box. Alright, well, if it's not on this side, then it's on the other. Is that the breaker box? 
Yay! I'm going around this way. It feels safer, you know? Who is this guy? Oh my god, another tape. Well, if he left me a tape, he's gonna let me watch it, right? So nothing's gonna happen in here. They will find you in pieces. Greg. Greg, please. Greg. It's, there's no weapon in here. There's nothing. He did his transaction in that cabin. He ruined so many lives. He wanted to ruin another life today. He wanted to sell them a couple of grams. Okay. Good thing I'm not a fan of this stuff, but I didn't want him to feel empty-handed. I decided to leave him a small surprise in that little cabin of his. Hey, uh, Greg, listen to me, man. I don't know what you've done in your life because this guy seems like a very sweet guy. Like, he's only killing bad people, I think. Maybe not even bad, really, because that last guy was probably just a drug dealer. <laughs> grams of what, dude? He's selling grams of what? To who? Why is that worth, I don't know, locking him up in a room and... oh. I don't know why that scared me so bad. It's just the back rooms. Honestly, that might be a better place to go right now. But, yeah, this guy's killing drug dealers and the mayor. I don't know what you did, Greg, but you fucked up, man. This is like the wrath of Hades coming up, coming down on you. He, like, put that guy in, I don't know, an oven or something. I'm not ending up nowhere, Mr. Serial Killer. I'm going... I'm going home. Kill me in my house, I dare you. This guy doesn't... Greg, you're not a real person. If there's anything about this game that's bugging me, it's the fact that Greg doesn't act like a normal person at all. Don't you think you should call somebody? Shouldn't you go to your mom's house? I don't know, man. You gotta do something. You're gonna end up in pieces. Like, at this point, what do you even want me to do for you? I can't do anything. You're, you're just gonna die. This game is fucking crazy. It's just good in that the killer is really... It's a really strong killer. Or at least a really strong... Alleged killer. He hasn't done anything yet, you know what I mean? But yeah, like... I believe that this killer is very, very lethal. You know? That's like the vibe that I get from him. I can't believe I'm still going to work. I can't believe it. It's an absolute mystery. Greg is an absolute enigma. He just doesn't give a fuck. He will just go to work. He will just do his job. Don't you understand what's going to happen to you? Don't you fucking get it, Greg? Oh boy. Alright, let's open this up. Okay. Oh. Oh no. I thought there was like something I could pick up. Hey man. What's up? Jenna. Hey Greg. Have you seen Matt? I can't find him anywhere. 
I haven't heard from him for a week. I really hope he's okay. Come find me after your shift to look at his house. We'll meet at your place. I don't know if that's something you want to do, Jenna. Believe me. What is this? Pro Cult strikes again. Fire more news. Dude, can someone get the fucking... Uh, get everybody. Get the Coast Guard. <laughs> get the Navy. Set up a perimeter around the entire city. The state, even. This is crazy. This cult is just hand-picking people and kidnapping them. And nobody's doing anything about it. Is that you, Rob? Derek, excuse me. Don't you think it's kind of late to do repairs on the roof? I just saw your co-worker on the roof fixing something. It's not safe. Go right now and tell this man to come down. Derek? Derek, I need you to fucking... Like, Greg, use your voice, man. Can you project? Can you say something? Do you understand what's happening here? I wonder if I could just leave. What is this? What... What have you done? Oh, is this me coming down from the, uh... What the fuck is going on? Am I the killer? Please don't fucking... Oh my god, what is that? No, 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 hold on. I want to see the tape. You have been quite the fan of my work. You seem to enjoy my work. I extend this invitation to you. Join me. Let's clean our city from these scums. Call me. You know what, man? Honestly, at this point, Greg, I fucking... I'd do it. My room smells like fresh linen. <laughs> thanks to my automatic spray. I love your work, Mr. Killer. Is that a body? Shut up, Greg, you idiot. Of course it is. I'm, like, infatuated with this killer then, right? Because I went to go home, and then I just appeared with... Look, man. I'm fucking... I'm all in. Take me in, dude. I can't... I can't go. Okay, I don't... Maybe that's not him. We shouldn't, uh... We shouldn't, uh, assume that random people in vans are killers. Though it makes a lot of sense. Where's Jenna? This can't keep happening. I need to end this now. You need to pick up the fucking phone and join this man because I don't see how else you're going to get out of this. Oh look, the mirror's back. I need to end this. Shut up, dude. Are you Master Chief? Are you gonna finish this fight? I don't fucking think so. There's a blue box in there and I can't grab it. Are these all the tapes? Where's Jenna? Oh, please. Okay. Okay, good. More tapes? Oh no. <laughs> More plates. Oh, here's the phone. I can call the police or the unknown number. Ooh. This is wild. I don't know. The police aren't gonna do anything. On the other hand, if I go to work, I'm going to die. And if I call this number, I'll become a killer. Look. I really do think that calling this unknown number and talking to this killer 
is the best option. Because we could just go right around and kill him, right? Like, we could just, like, yeah, show me how you do this, and then fucking hit him over the back of the head with a sledgehammer. Look, I'm all in on figuring out who this killer is. At least we'll know who it is, right? The news gave me the name of the abductor. Oh, shit. I'm not interested in acts of violence. However, I adore this little rotten town and I will do anything to clean it from the filth it has. Wow, that's it, huh? Do I have to restart the entire game in order to... Oh my god, I have to do everything all over again? Just to see what happens? That's crazy talk, man. It took me 40 minutes to get here. Alright, so I went through the game again to see if I could get to the ending faster. And the answer is no. You have to painfully wait for everything to happen to do anything. And looking back, I like regret not having called the police just so I could see me die. But I didn't expect the ending where we become a killer to be so lackluster, you know what I mean? In any case, that is what I would have done. So, there we- well, what I would have done is fucking run the fuck away. I would have gone to mom's house immediately. I would have moved to the other side of the country, but whatever. Anyway, what do I think of VHS Slaughter? I think this game has a really, really, really effective killer. So the gameplay, the dialogue, the mechanics, whatever, they're all very simplistic. But the thing that really helps this game a lot is that the killer is scary. You don't even see him. We don't know who it is. I still don't know who it is. Um, I just know that this guy could 100% fucking kill us at any time, and he's just choosing not to for whatever reason, which I guess in this case is because we were interested in his tapes. Maybe if we weren't, then he would have just killed us or left us alone. I don't know. Um, but yeah, the killer is definitely the most effective part of this game. The rest of it is just your real standard walking simulator type stuff that I don't hate. I mean, it's effective in telling a story, right? Otherwise, I wouldn't have been so scared so often. But yeah, I actually really like this game, and I'm sure most of you did too. I just don't know if the horror is conveyed well to you guys. That's the one thing I'm worried about, because I was scared. I just don't know if that was if that transfers over through video as well. Um, I guess you guys could let me know that. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for voting on the soda that I drank today. And I'll have another poll up soon. But for now, thank you guys a ton for watching. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.